I'm John Pollock with the City of Oak Harbor, and I'm an engineering technician and I work in the Public Works Department. One of the frequent questions that we get at the City of Oak Harbor is, why isn't West Whidbey Avenue being paved? It's a great question. So let's talk about it. Works, we believe strongly in the core value of being responsible stewards of this money that you, the citizens, trust us with, especially when it comes to investing in the infrastructure that so many of us rely on every day. In order to best meet that core value, we sincerely want to ensure that those projects take a whole picture approach so that necessary work can proceed in a logical fashion. So when it comes to choosing which roads we pay first, there are many factors to consider aside from how well the road looks or how well it drives. One of these factors is the amount of traffic that a road carries each and every day. On average, 10,000 vehicles travel this section of West Whidbey Avenue each and every day, from school buses filled with our children, to mail carriers, commuters, garbage trucks, and emergency services, West Whidbey Avenue serves as a vital transportation link to serve all of us that live in and around the city of Oak Harbor. We understand the importance of ensuring that West Whidbey Avenue is open and passable to everyone. And it is also equally important that it is a pleasant traveling experience. We understand that West Whidbey Avenue is in rough shape right now and we apologize for the delays that have occurred in getting it repaired. When it comes to paving projects, we also have to consider what lies underneath our roads, our utilities, our water, our sewer, and our storm drains. Of critical importance on West Whidbey Avenue is the material and the age of the water main. This section of Whidbey Avenue has the longest section of steel water main that's still in service in the city. That steel water main was installed in the 1950s. It's around 70 years old, and so it has well exceeded its service life. In the last five years alone, the Public Works Water Division has responded to 20 different water leaks along West Whidbey Avenue. In addition to that, when the fire department connects their fire engines whenever they need to access the water for saving lives and protecting properties, that demand on the water system can scour that steel water main and cause rust through discolored brown and red water that shows up in your homes, and it can also cause additional leaks. So needless to say, it is well past time for us to replace this water main. And even though you may not see it right now, work is underway to go ahead and replace it. The engineering division is working through the survey and design phase of this water main replacement project. We will be replacing the steel water main from Oak Harbor Street to Discovery Street, and then from Discovery Street onto Jib, we are going to be replacing a cement water main as well. The cement water main is susceptible to vibrations from road paving equipment, and those vibrations can cause that cement water main to crack, and that will cause a washout of the roadway. And we want to ensure that that doesn't happen, so we need to replace it as well before we pave the rest of Whidbey Avenue. The new water main will be made of a modern heavy-duty PVC. It will be increased in size from the six inches in diameter that it currently is now to eight inches in diameter to meet our current city standards and to better serve our fire department and our continued growth of our city. We will also be undertaking the work to replace the water services for the homes that are along West Whidbey Avenue to the benefit of the residents that reside here. Those water services are also equally as old, dating in time since the 1950s. So while we have now answered the question of why it's taking so long for us to repair Whidbey Avenue, we should answer for you when that work will be done. We anticipate having a complete set of plans in the winter of 2022, and we will begin breaking ground in the spring of 2023. Once the work to replace the water main is completed, paving of West Whidbey Avenue will follow swiftly in the summer of 2023. We continue to keep you informed of progress on this project and many others through presentations to the City Council, articles in the Whidbey News Times, and through our social media channels on YouTube, Facebook, and Instagram. If you have any questions about this project or any of the others, please feel free to email us at info at oakharbor.org. Thank you for your time.